गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एम गोन बी शेयरिंग सम ऑफ माई टॉप फेवरेट लिप एंड चीक टिंस दर आर अवेलेबल इन इंडिया लिप एंड चीक टिंस एंड क्रीम ब्लशेज हैव बिन द मोस्ट पॉपुलर मेकअप प्रोडक्ट्स दिस ईयर आई विल बी डूइंग अ डेडिकेटेड वीडियो फॉर क्रीम ब्लशेज एज वेल सो स्टे ट्यून फॉर दैट बट इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोन बी टॉकिंग ऑल अबाउट लिप एंड चीक टिंस आई पर्सनली लव यूजिंग टिंस ऑन अ डे टू डे बेसिस इफ यर सम वन हु डज अ नो मेकअप मेकअप लुक वेरी ऑफन आई थिंक यू विल लव टिंस द मोस्ट बिकॉज इट लुक्स वेरी नेचुरल इट इज ईजी टू यूज एंड ऑल्सो दे आर सच मल्टी पर्पज प्रोडक्ट्स यू कैन यूज दैम ऑन योर आईज योर चीक्स एज वेल एज योर लिप्स ऑल्सो नाइका हैज द हॉट पिंक सेल गोइंग ऑन करंटली एंड दे हैव क्रेजी क्रेजी डिस्काउंट्स इन सम ऑफ दीज प्रोडक्ट्स राइट नाउ सी यू गाइज कैन डेफिनेटली चेक दम आउट आई एम गोन लीव ऑल द प्रोडक्ट लिंक्स इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स बिलो and now let's get right into the video so i have two different categories one is a cream lip and cheek tint which comes in this pot kind of a packaging and one is a liquid lip and cheek tint so let's start with the cream ones first so i have the just herbs lip and cheek tint and the daughter earth one both of these i would say are pretty similar i like the daughter earth one a little bit more because it's a little more creamy and easy to blend this is also pretty good and easy to blend but i just prefer the daughter earth one more um depends on the shade as well i have three shades in the just herbs lip and cheek tints one is rose coral which is by the way my most favorite i think this color looks the most flattering on my skin tone it's like a very variable red kind of a color the other two shades are pink forever which is my least used color because it's a bright pink blush and i don't really wear this a lot um the other one that i really like is soft nude this is like a very warm nude kind of a color which would suit so many skin tones these lip and cheek tints by just herbs are easy to blend they're pretty long lasting and they look good on the lips too i just think that after a while it makes your lips really chapped so i don't really prefer to wear these on my lips very often coming on to the daughter earth one these are slightly more creamier and easy to blend than the just herbs one and again i have three shades in this uh the first one is my favorite which is desert nude and this is a very nice warm brown chocolatey kind of a shade which looks much better on my lips rather than my cheeks so this is one of my favorite shades then i have one of their popular shades which is the original pink and again this looks very flattering on my skin tone whenever i want to wear a nice wearable pink blush i reach out to this one a lot this is a really pretty flattering pink color and lastly i have the shade rouge rose this is a very bright red color and i don't reach out for this much but i think this would look really good on deeper skin tones another tint which is as good as the daughter earth and the just herbs one but is much cheaper is by tnw the natural wash and it's their lip and cheek tint in the shade tunnel of love i think this is a much better formula because this is much more creamier than the other two it is so easy to blend this is a very wearable red color it is um very close to the shade rose coral actually these other two colors they are pretty similar they're not that different and this again lasts really long on your skin it looks good on the lips too so this is again something that you need to try if you don't want to spend that much on the daughter earth one or the just herbs one and then my most favorite lip and cheek tint formula that is in a cream form it's by pure by priyanka and it's their glamour red lip and cheek tint this is how it looks like you get three times more quantity in this one and the formula is just beautiful and the formula is much more different than all of the other three lip and cheek tints that i shared this is much more hydrating very moisturizing on the skin looks a little bit dewy and it is very very lightweight and easy to blend you will really not have to put a lot of effort to blend this product it blends so seamlessly on the skin and this shade looks very flattering on me it is extremely extremely pigmented so you just need a tiny amount of this product i think this formula is truly worth trying and you get so much more quantity in it now let's start with all of the liquid lip and cheek tints that i have i have 3 of them Let's start with the most popular one which is by Benefit. This is the Benefit Benetint and I have the travel size bottle which is actually enough quantity of product that you would need. 
So this is the most popular lip and cheek tint because it has a very very water like texture. It is literally water on your skin and it is very very pigmented. It is also the most long lasting lip and cheek tint that you will ever try and it blends really seamlessly. You don't have to put any effort and it also looks very skin like and natural on your face. You can literally use this with no makeup on your skin and it will look very very natural. I do reach out for this product but I still think that this looks much better on people with lighter skin tones i think it shows up more on their skin tone people who are more on the dusky to deeper skin tones category i think you will have to use a lot more product for it to show up on your skin and that's what i don't like about the product otherwise the product is really good if you are someone with lighter skin tone i think you will just need one or two dots of this product on your skin and it will look very natural and pigmented the most closest dupe that i have of the benetint is the elana's beet tint this is not exactly the same texture wise but it is a very watery lip and cheek tint it is a very lightweight product and it looks exactly like benetint on my skin i think it looks very very natural it is so easy to blend it looks as natural as benetint and that's why i think it's a very very close dupe i personally think if you have the elana beet tint then you don't really need benetint because they are very similar they both are definitely very different when it comes to shade this is a more brighter red color and this is more on the pink side so the shades are different but if you don't want to spend that much on the benetint then you can definitely try the elana beet tint and you will really really like it and lastly i have another very popular lip and cheek tint and it's their water fit tint by the face shop this is very different from benetint and the elana cheek tint this is much thicker in consistency and it is much more pigmented it is extremely pigmented you have to work really quickly with this tint i prefer using either a brush or a sponge with this product i don't like to use it with my fingers because you have to quickly blend this before it sets overall this tint is really great the shade is beautiful it looks very flattering on my skin tone and also it is extremely long lasting but honestly if i'm on the go and i have to use a tint quickly with my fingers just in 2 minutes then i reach out for these two products out of all of the other tints that i've shared i think i reach out to these two the most so this is it for today's video i hope you guys found the video helpful i will leave all the product links in the description box below so don't forget to check that out please don't forget to hit that like button subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon besides it to get notified whenever i upload a new video and i will see you guys in my next video bye